sorry about that. There's, there's going to be a little bit of echo going on, but whatever. All right, listen. As much as we got detour, the focus right now is doing some motherfucking sleep tight, okay? We're about to get into this shit, man. We got to see who more, uh, more, more ways. Oh, more, 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 more nights. We more nights, yeah. We got to get, we got to see who can do the most nights, all right? I'm still in this motherfucking tutorial mode, okay? Yeah, we're back. We're back, man. Yo, listen, man. I took a little while to get back in here, bro. Um, recreational reasons. <laughs> bro, Luke Bomber. Luke, oh, 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 I see you Luke, instigating this, stuff on Twitter, by the way. Uh -huh, okay? Uh -huh. I saw nothing. There was nothing listen, there. There was nothing Get there. Get out of here. Stop <laughs> acting like, listen, they ain't, you ain't seen no pussy. You ain't seen no motherfucking titties. Okay. okay? Nothing. It was just, there was okay. just some, there was just we some know penny. that's what you're trying to see. Yeah, though, man. Okay? We know, we know you're desperate. You know, I, I don't know you know why Luke Bomber does it? He, he's a pervert. Really? He's a pervert. Really? Nigga be motherfucking creepy. He's a, he's a hentai. He be, he, he motherfucking, you, 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 you baka no jin? Huh? Baka? Oh yeah, that's different. I don't know how hentai. I don't know how you would use it. This Are you a stupid pervert? Yeah. Oh, ba is that what you said? Baka hentai. Or yeah. Baka, yeah. I think baka hentai. you ba you baka hentai, nigga. Man, mm. I don't know what the hell it is. Don't listen to Luke Bomber. Don't listen to any of these motherfuckers who be memeing up shit on the channel. They don't have legitimate opinions. Okay. <laughs> this shit don't matter. Hey, this nigga's in the chat. Yeah, yeah. Luke, he said baka. Yo, yeah. Okay. Get the. You know, as a matter of fact, Luke Bomber, because you're trying, trying to. You're trying to motherfucking incriminate niggas. I gotta, I, I gotta, I gotta hit you with it, bro. I'm sorry, Luke. You're my nigga. Oh, no. You're oh, my no. nigga. But I mean, I have to. You gotta, sometimes you gotta put. You gotta, you you gotta, gotta just. You, got, you gotta go for the motherfucking head, bro. Luke, I'm sorry, man. I had to do it to him. I had to do it to him. <laughs> All right. Now there is something to do. Um, he says, "Yo, what the fuck is? Where the fuck is the sponsor chat on the stream, man? I can't fucking." It's too much fucking shit to do to be able to get that shit working right, man. We ain't got no time for the sponsor shit, man. Listen, <laughs> listen, man, fuck the sponsor. <laughs> fuck, fuck the sponsors, okay? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, he, uh, he loves his sponsors. I don't give a fuck about these things. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Anyways, all right. Now, we have the game here. Okay, I still didn't get to finish my motherfucking playthrough, okay? Now, I'm not going to continue the topic that we discussed before I ended the last stream because it kind of got me into a little bit of hot... Well, not really. Nothing happened. Nothing got shut down, okay? We're good. Uh, I'm going to just activate whatever. I don't know. And what else do we do? Ammo? All right. There we go. Let's go. Night number five, bro. We're about to get it in, man. Let me see. I think we're still in the tutorial, bro, but I... I, I that's the thing that makes this thing kind of difficult too. The fact that you have to allocate ammo. What the fuck are these little dog things? Oh, yeah, those, those are nasty motherfuckers. Damn. Oh, they they attack the turret? Oh, okay, okay. Fuck. Yo. Dude's coming for my giblets. Uh uh, uh uh. Where do I see my ammo? Oh, never mind. I see it. I see it. I see it. Okay, okay, okay. Bro, hold on a second. Why this shit so intense for? What kind of shit? What area does this kid live in that he's got motherfucking aliens busting down his door every night? What kind of parent is this? Your child is being killed. What is going on here? They murdered a boy in his room. They killed the little nigga. That's crazy to me. Wow. They're laughing. <laughs> this is crazy. It's funny. A, a, a child was murdered <laughs> by, a, by a monster. <laughs> a purple demon. We have a, a donation coming in. From Huh? Oh, he can play as a girl. Oh, okay, all right. Yeah, he's gone. He's he f f in the chat for this little man. Oh, uh, hold on. We have another donation coming in here. This time coming in from Momo. Oh no, I know what that means. <laughs> Listen, C and D, we have a demon in the fucking stream. Okay. What? Have you ever heard of Momo? I thought it was like Momo. No, it's not that one. Not that demon. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Momo. <laughs> Bro, Momo come got into some shit. How the fuck did she manage to dig herself that deep? I never had a bad experience with Momo come personally. How the fuck? Dude, I, I had good experiences with it, dude. Like, we, we, like, we, we hit it 
it was, it was like it was like her, me, and then. You guys got, got the yeah, girls yeah. that upgraded. Yeah. And, and like we, we went out one night and like we, we were having fun. Dude, I literally made her like laugh, like like roll on the floor type laughing. Like we we were it was um we were getting like food or something and the guy was like making the burrito and you remember the whole the whole uh, um uh, the big shack guy that was like yeah, around yeah. that time with the whole meme and the whole the whole ski bop bop and all that stuff and I was like put, yeah I was putting on like sound effects so when the guy was doing it and like he timed like I timed it perfectly when he like s- s- hit some stuff down I was like and a boom, boom 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 and like dude it was so perfect and she started cracking up so like dude we hit it off like she's a good person she's genuine but like she got wrapped up with she got like wrapped up oh with some shit. Some, yeah. Bro. Which is like I'm not defending. I'm defending yeah, yeah, the yeah. point that like people that are in this certain light or that do the things that she does or like that we do yeah. get like an exponentially amount more of hate than a normal person would just they because do. of that. You yeah, know what I mean? And stuff does like to snowball. People do like to jump on. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. At the same time, what she did wasn't was, right yeah, by any means. Cool. Like, yeah, and she realizes cool. that too. That's why she apologized. That's why she's trying to grow. She's trying to be different. Like one, if one of us ran around grabbing anime titties and squeezing, I'd ass, be calling you out. Yeah, yeah. I'd yeah, be going exactly. live, bro. I'd be like, motherfucker, you be, we be in jail. Like, Attica, what are you doing, motherfucker? Like, if I did that shit, I wouldn't even be able to be on the stream to defend myself. I'd be in prison, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'd be doing hey, an IRL stream from you through the glass. Yeah, it'd be like, yo, I'm chilling with Attica here. I'd be like, yo. <laughs> I don't have to bring the stream to you. Like, God damn, bro. But yeah, you know, like. Unfortunately, listen, listen, hopefully she learned her lesson, she comes back to the scene, and she's not fucking up again, you know? That's what I hope. I mean, it's easy to learn from that kind of I thing, too. I can't imagine how hard that, I mean, like, she, she ain't killed nobody. The whole internet, though, just the whole internet, her, you know what I bro, mean? Bro, there's this place crazy. called Lolcal, and they, like, bro, the, the, the shit they be saying on there, it reminds me of 4chan back in the days, you know, the, the, the old 4chan, the good 4chan, so, I mean, that's how fucked up it is. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> Uh, let me see here. All right, all right. Listen, commenters, if you're in my live stream right now, you're posting a YouTube comment or whatever. I want to see it, man. What are y'all saying, man? Um, the stream got yeeted by porn. No, it didn't. What are you talking about? You no talking idea. About? Like, I, 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 it just, it just dropped. It, just, yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. Like, it ain't always got to be about me doing some fucked up shit that makes Why the stream go down. Oh, do y'all jump to this negativity so fast. <laughs> listen, man. I can't wait till I get my flamethrower. Elon Musk got my. You ordered the flamethrower? Did you get it? No. Damn, bro. Why didn't you get it? It's a flamethrower. It's like two thousand dollars, isn't it? No, it was a five hundred. That was not that. So it's still expensive, yeah. But I mean, it's a flamethrower. <laughs> Why did you get a flamethrower? I got it, bro. It's coming in like I thought August. That, I thought he only like made like two thousand or something. He outside. did, and I bought that motherfucker in like that when time when, came out. when it, as soon as I saw that you he did, made a flamethrower. Putting his flamethrower in his vlog for like months now. Why don't you still have yours? I I really. Oh wait, wait, really? He was showing probably because he he, he picked it up. He probably I mean, picked he it up. No break, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like they also had like places where they would give niggas the flamethrowers right away, so they would just like, oh, come here if you want to pick it up early. I didn't get mine earlier. I'm having it shipped out. Mm-hmm. hundred percent, bro. Listen, when you move to when you move to New York, maybe we can burn down no, your apartment. We'll burn it down, literally. Yeah, bro. Okay, okay. I'm down. I'm game. I'm your game? game? You game to lose your home? Man, that sounds good. I lose mine too, bro. Uh, someone said, hello, Desmond and Mofa. How are you doing at this time? Bro, listen, I'm going to tell you one thing. Vegas is treating me real nice. You see these chips, my boy? Hold on a second. I'm going to tell you one thing. How much money are we looking at right here? This is chip money right now. Listen, I'm gonna t- do you want me to teach y'all niggas who haven't been to Vegas exactly how Vegas works, all right? Over here, you see this? I'm gonna open my wallet. Do you see what I'm looking like? Okay, I have no currency in my wallet. <laughs> you don't Thanks, need. <laughs> Listen, Etika broke network. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> why you think I'm streaming? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Anyways, motherfuckers, right? Look at this. These are chips. This chip okay. worth a hundred twenty-five. Where'd you get these from? Five twenty-five. Bro, oh, these these. This is the currency of Las Vegas. You already went out? Uh, uh-huh, yeah, I already hit the tables, bro. I'm already up. That's I'm already up almost 200. 100 right there? 100, that's $100, bro. You can pay for shit with that. You can go to a taxi and be like, yo, here you go. Oh, wait, wait, I and think that, that person needs it. What happened? Oh, what happened? <laughs> bro, bro, I just got him so good. <laughs> <laughs> I got you so good. You actually. Oh, this motherfucker.
motherfucker stole my chip. <laughs> I didn't even realize you what he was doing. You oh, actually, oh. He actually just went up to some random people and said, I was like, oh, they said something? I, oh. I was just stealing his poker chips. Oh. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> Boy, you got juked so I got, bad. Damn, bro. This was, <laughs> damn, that was real life, bro. <laughs> No, no, no. Okay, yeah. All right. Listen, man. You know what? I gotta watch this guy. I when in Vegas, listen. I gotta watch you. Someone's gonna. Someone. Nah, no one's taking my chips, bro. Listen, I'm about to make. I'm about to double these, bro. I'm about to double them. Bro, that. Skull Kid donated twenty five dollars, bro. Wait, wait. You know that nigga? Yeah, no, that's a girl. Oh shit, that's a woman. Yeah, she, oh. she um, she came out to um. Uh, meet up I had uh, at PAX West. Oh, that's She's cool. Shit, man, listen, we welcome any estrogen we can get in this community, man. There's barely enough of it. Hold yeah, on. don't think we're like creepy when we're like, yeah, oh we're my not... god, there's a girl. But yeah, like, it's just like... <laughs> that's a good thing. And and you as guys out there, too, in the gaming community in general. Yeah, right? appreciate like, the ladies, appreciate man. and just treat them like well, normal welcome people. Welcome them with open arms. Because I mean, girls are still, I mean, the, the, the reality, girls are still like, not as like not as, prevalent in the scene as no, men are, you know? That's, that's not, that's not and we need thing. to celebrate that, you know? I'm not trying to like motherfucking I appeal to, to, to Punani. No, I'm just saying we need, we need, it'd be nice to have diversity. I am an advocate for diversity within demographics appealing to gender. You sound so thirsty. Uh-uh, uh-uh, nigga. What are you talking? Yeah, yeah, it's true. Yeah, it's true. It's true. You see? <laughs> Hold on a second. Respect women. <laughs> CND sucks his mom. Listen, that's not a, that's not any of your business whether he does or he doesn't, okay? Hold on. Um, Edica, I heard you have both of these. What? what Y'all coming up with these random diseases. This just sound like a motherfucking page out of the Old Testament of the Bible, nigga. Like, what is this? Oh, uh, Etika, can you watch Matt Pat's video? I would, but Duke, I don't know if taking a stream full of savages to a suicide video is going to be a good idea. Maybe we should leave that alone. I don't think so. The timing is really bad. You know what I'm saying? This is so sad. Can we hit 50 women? What will you achieve by doing that? Someone said we can achieve a goal of hitting 50 women. Why would you hit? Why would you make that a goal to hit 50 women? Like, I don't know if that one's gonna fly. I don't know if that's gonna fly, my friend. We can do it. Hit 50 women. Like, no. Uh, let me see here. Uh, respect, blah, blah blah. Any Vegas parties? Yes, there are, my friend. And I unfortunately won't be able to experience that many of them with CND because he's leaving soon. Actually, you're only here for like two more days. Or? Yeah, I'm leaving Friday night. Friday night? I gotta go to Retro Palooza in Houston, Texas. Oh, okay. Yeah, Retro Palooza. Sounds like some shit, man. But I mean, hey, we're gonna enjoy our time while we're here. Maybe we'll record some stuff. It's the only way. Only way to enjoy your time. Oh, Oh, dude. That's what I'm saying, man. Bob the Builder came Bob the Builder. What's going on? Like one of the dudes that like makes this whole thing. I know, right? Respect to you, my friend. Listen. He listen, this dude, he's not as just regular as he looks, okay? This <laughs> motherfucker's hiding the truth from y'all motherfuckers, all right? Listen, let me get a one in the chat for my boy right here. Tell, tell these motherfuckers hey, who you are. I, will, I, I would be happy to. Thank you for asking. Uh, I am Banks Boutte. I am uh, the executive producer of Sleep Tight, co-writer, and I co-founded the studio We Are Fuzzy, which is uh, a partnership between me and my partner, Max. A um, little backstory on the game, Max and Jed, who is our other partner, Max is the gameplay director, uh, they grew up together and they were building pillow forts and we're like, shit, we could, we could make our, we could make this into a game one day. And then they, they grew up and Max became one of the top visual effects artists in the world. He's worked on Game of Thrones and Iron Man and Far Cry and Halo and everything in between. He's making all this like really dark adult content, worked on a lot of David Fincher product, projects, which you know are as, as dark as it gets. Literally, like he'd say, like he was doing the, the title sequence of that new David Fincher show. What's that show called? Anyone out there in the chat know? What's a new David Fincher uh, Netflix show? They're, they're cops and they're like investigating real dark murders. Anyway, he, he, he did the opening titles and he said like literally he was going outside to like dry heave every day because he was like zoomed in on cadavers and shit. And, uh, and he was like, you know what I want to do? I want to make, make the game about our childhood. And, you know, so he and Jed, who grew up together, Jed had seven years ago made the prototype for Sleep Tight. And so they've been cranking on this thing, and they got a bunch of their uh, their yeah. friends. Yes, wait, it's Mind Hunter, Mind Hunter, exactly. Whoever that was, well done. CFX, bang, orang, bazing, zang. Oh, we, and we got chocolate chip cookies here all night. Oh, shit. I don't, okay, I don't listen, know. If, that's why I need to come here tomorrow, man. Yes, yes. Open to the public tomorrow night. Come hang out with your boy. It's gonna be fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 8 p.m. Uh, here at the gaming lounge at the Rio. The Rio in Las Vegas. Las Vegas. 
Um, yeah, and so uh, so like shit, we could we could make our game. Jed became a great programmer as an adult, mm-hmm. and um, and then they got a bunch of their buddies from Disney, so guys who worked on Zootopia and Wreck It Ralph and Big Hero Six helped to make this childhood story come to life. It looks polished as hell. I'll tell you that. Man. Thank you, man. We have we have spent so much effort on this thing. Yeah, bro, like the artwork and all this other stuff, man. Listen, you niggas don't understand or appreciate how much effort goes into a video game of this. The scale, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is actually something that's like serious here, and it's high action. That's what I'm saying. There's, there's no turn base. There's no motherfucking take your turn. I go next. No, this is like in your face type shit right here. Okay, I respect that as, as you know, someone who plays video games who prefers like action based stuff. Like, I think it's like actually going to be oh, a good time. Mm, right just, on, man. Yeah, man. And what, when, when can people find this? When this, people... thank, thank you, Brass. And this comes out tomorrow at 10 a.m. So does it come out on Switch and Steam? In the morning, so we are going to be streaming here from this gaming lounge um, all the way through the launch tomorrow. So, okay. so this is our slumber party. Yeah, excellent, excellent. yeah man. Listen, man. Yeah, man. Hey, thank th- you. Thank you guys for Appreciate rocking it. That, man. Look, the mic, you said the mic is messed up, dude. Sorry about that. Oh, it's a little low. Speak directly into the shit, man. All right, hold on a second. That's one of the big wigs in here right now. All right, that's one of the motherfucking big wigs. So far. So far, in terms of like the game, I don't think the game is bad. The game is the game is actually it's actually kind of engaging. I mean, the amount of characters that you can use and shit. I don't know if it's my type of game. I don't know if that is my type of game. But so far, I'm not having a bad experience. My bad, I missed that donation coming in from EW Network from earlier. Thank you for the 25. And coming in right now, we have uh, a returning donator. This dude's name's Bo 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 Bo. He says, "Click this." Where I see a status from Shad Base. I know already. I already know that's bad news. As a matter of fact, bro, I don't even have to motherfucking click your damn donation. I'm just gonna go to Shad Base's motherfucking Twitter page right now and see what other controversy this dude has gotten himself into besides drawing little girls in questionable positions. What it, Shad? That nigga follows me too, bro. I hope you haven't getting getting your ass in trouble, bro. So far, I'm looking like my my timeline's full of porn. Uh, let me see if I can salvage something here. Wakanda forever. The chain says it all, bro. I've been wearing this for. Like almost a year now, bro. Ask C and D what happened to Pluto. Listen, I'm not even gonna bother bringing that up, man. We're gonna be gonna be we're gonna we're gonna be respectful of that, okay? Sometimes shit don't work out. Yo, Aurora's in here too. My dude came through with 25 bones, dropping it on the Joy-Con boy's head right there. He says, "My man, I see you're out here wilding in Vegas. Stay safe, bro, and enjoy your trip." Listen, I can't give you a guarantee on one of those things, and it damn sure ain't enjoying my trip. Listen, this might be the last time niggas see me in the flesh, and by the time it all is over, bro, you're just gonna have a motherfucking funeral service for my bitch ass. But no guarantees there. Obviously, I don't know, but. Bro, okay, let me see. What's going on with Shad's page? Is this like a status, bro, that involves me, or is it just something fucked up that happened to him? Uh, wow. Okay, I'm just seeing a couple things. I wish I could open up the fucking actual post. I can't really open up links right now, dudes. My goddamn, <laughs> I'll be real with you. Like my, my goddamn setup doesn't really encourage that. Yo, my retro, what's going on, brother? You chilling, man? Uh, what's going on? Okay, okay, hold on. Dudes, we gotta play some more of this game. I wanna at least get through the fucking tutorial, all right? Listen, I know we don't really do games like that, but we're, we're gonna try to see if we can get something out of this, man. And maybe we'll, yo, let's do a raid. It's been so long since I've done a raid. There's so few content creators that I can honestly say that I really enjoy watching that I just send raid love to. But I wouldn't mind doing a raid. You know what? Maybe we can, like, can I really, let me see. Can I try to open a link on my motherfucking computer? Is it possible? Okay, okay, I think it, okay, here we go, here we go. All right, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go on motherfucking twitch.tv. Let's see who the hell's streaming, what the hell's going on over here. Yes, I know, no bitch niggas, no snitch niggas, etc., etc. but um, for now, we're gonna be changing the rules. Hold on, wait. Where's the, okay, here we go, here we go. All right, I'm kind of curious. It's been a little while since I've explored the deep regions of Twitch, okay? Raid Shofu? Is Shofu streaming right now, bro? I gotta log into my account. That takes way too much effort, bro. I'm about to just motherfucking see. Well, I would like to see who's streaming that I kind of know, but... Hmm. Okay, you know what? I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to Browse. Can we show by channels? 
and we're going to is this like the most people so currently speaking we have um tsm daquan who's streaming he's playing fortnite fortnite irl dota i don't know what the hunter is but um, fortnite okay okay let's see if there's any familiar names in here ninja wait a minute ninja's streaming and he's i mean it's ninja right like i'm not going to sit here and talk down on but you know this is one time he's streaming that he only has like 14,000 viewers. <laughs> only 14,000. That's kind of crazy to say, right? But you know what? My nigga Ninja's streaming, bro. Let's see if we can hit this nigga with a little bit of love, okay, bro? I don't know what the hell we're going to say. But I mean... <laughs> oh, God. Wait, can you even type? Hello? Hello? Nope. Nah, we, okay, we can't even type. Fuck, what's the fucking point then? Raid Maximilian Dude? That nigga Maximilian Dude is streaming? Hold on. You know what's funny? Maximilian Dude, he's kind of like this guy that a lot of people, I guess, kind of look at us in a similar way. Because we kind of like, our cha his channel's bigger than mine, but I don't know. We kind of do sort of similar stuff, but not really at the same time. But I've seen a lot of his stuff. You know, it's not like I'm subscribed to him to where it's like I enjoy his content like that. But I mean, the dude seems kind of cool to me, man. Like, I wouldn't mind hanging with him at some point, man. The dude seems all right. Yo, man, let's see if we can, let's see how he's going to respond to a fucking raid. <laughs> That's the thing. If y'all remember back in the old days, remember when Angry Joe shitted on us, man, for raiding his ass? So, I mean, you got to be careful with what we do with this power, okay? This is not something that you just wave around nonchalant bro you don't just wave a motherfucking <laughs> you don't just wave a motherfucking <laughs> um, who are we raiding we're raiding this nigga max dude okay here we go we, we're about to hit him up let's see how he responds man is he gonna be a good sport or what <laughs> and the fucking stream just shut down did that have something to do with us or nah let me see here we're gonna give him a second bro joy con niggas is in here okay try to be try to be cool with it don't be too crazy all right so far okay joy con boys etika Blah, 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 Joy-Con boys, blah, blah, blah. Okay, 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 so far, so good. Nothing too crazy. Keep it respectful. Keep it respectful. K-I-R. Kern. Keep it respectful. Nigga, Kern, okay? Remember the K-I-R-N policy. The Kern policy. When we raid niggas, we keep it Kern, okay? What the f- Okay, this nigga's playing Monster Hunter, bro. Is this the one on the motherfucking- This is the Monster Hunter on the PS4, bro? This shit is pretty as fuck. Ooh, nigga. Why couldn't we get this on the Switch, though? Okay, okay. I, have I told you about my idea before what they gotta do for the Switch? What? And how they could literally make it like that. Oh. A Switch Dock Pro. Yeah, that actually boosts the fucking- Yeah. It we, upscales it, just puts mm -hmm. more fans on it and stuff, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Some real shit. They need that. They need that. Bro, we're trying to raid this dude. The shit isn't really... It's not really... Oh, okay. There are a couple yeah, of people. Yeah, Joy Is he saying... Let me see here. What's he saying? I'm about to hit my live right now. Okay, you about to start streaming, bro? Finally, yeah. Shit, it took long enough. Let's go. Yeah. I'll do it right now for a second. Right, uh, okay, I'm not really seeing a response from him. Maybe it's because he doesn't like me, but I don't know. Is he reading his chat or no? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. He's not even reading his chat. Okay, I think he is now, yeah. Hey, this nigga, man. Damn right, man. Joy <laughs> he knows the memes. Did he get it? Yeah, he got it. Yeah, he, he oh, said, no, not Joy Con going, boys. Going? Are we live? Oh, shit. Go, let me show my ass on camera. I'm in, I'm in the middle of, I'm in the middle of bombing C and D stream and and bombing motherfucker. This shit, motherfucker, it's a raid. <laughs> well, yeah, my boy Alex is streaming, bro. Let's go to his YouTube channel real quick. Let's see, we're gonna we're gonna do a motherfucking Inception thing right now. My stream and his stream, from my stream. Okay, let's see. C and Daddy. Is this channel gonna pop up? Where's Technic 
Medical help. My mic's not working. Oh shit. No. Why is this working? Okay. I don't know what the fuck we're looking at here, but yo, we have we have to get back to this game, bro. We have to get back to this game. I've been fucking up. I don't I don't know what the hell that was, but that definitely wasn't Alex. What you say? I went I searched up CN Daddy on YouTube. Why? Something popped up. A channel. My channel popped up? Not your channel. <laughs> okay, let's continue. Let's start the shit up, bro. Yo, Maximilian News, shout out to that nigga, though, man. We haven't even gotten it. We haven't really talked, but I mean, yo, I, I figure I show some love, man. Like, shit, man. Hopefully everything's been going good with you, dogs. Fuck, this YouTube shit, man. Sometimes, bro, there's people that you never interact with for, like, years on end. And then you finally, like, I don't know. It's just It's a good to bridge the gap sometimes. I don't know. Okay, let's go. So this is a different... Oh, she's got a motherfucking piece on her. Hold on a second. This chick is motherfucking burning right now. Okay, hold on. Let's try again. Here we go. She has a lot more ammo, though. Okay. 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 It's getting a little late night, though. So we're gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna play the game a little bit more, and then we're gonna talk about some wild shit. All right? Don't worry. I know some of you dudes. Listen, I'm gonna be real, Yo, man. E W Nutworth. Uh, e W Nut. That's one of my boys. Yeah. Nutworth. Oh, okay. Yeah. He. he yeah, because he, he's used to making them nuts work. This freaking nuts. This motherfucker. Bro. How you gonna hit a lady in the back of the head for anything other than donkey punch? <laughs> nah, it's fucked up. Donkey punch. Yo, do you guys know what a donkey punch is? Do you know what a donkey punch is? Bro, when I learned, it fucking fucked me up. Because I was like, I was like maybe like 17 years old. Yo, a donkey punch is when you're having sex with a woman, right? From the back. Like you're hitting it from the back. Apparently, there's this move where the dude punches the fuck out of the back of her head, makes her black out, and apparently it causes the vaginal muscles to tighten around his penis, and it like feels really good. That's like some, what kind of caveman, abusive ass motherfucking lug jaw, fist dragon shit is that? Who does that? He's the behind the scenes right now, say hello to the vlog. I don't know, we just talked about that. What? <laughs> Can you believe that shit? That's a thing. We just do that. Y'all didn't know that? Yo, do y'all know what a dirty Sanchez is? Apparently, it's when someone engages in anal sex and some of it winds up on your lip. And like, like they call that a dirty Sanchez. That's not, like, I don't know why I'm talking about dark sexual shit with y'all, but I mean... It just was shock, st shocking stuff that I learned, man. Like, it kind of fucked me up when I was a kid. You ever had those moments when you're a little kid and you discover something sexual and you're, you feel crazy? Yo, I'll never forget the first porno mag that I've ever read or gotten. I was in the seventh grade, right? My friend Christian. Christian? I'm not even going to say his last name. I remember his last name. He was one of my best friends, right? But I remember back in those days, it was like I was I, I, I was a good boy, you know? I've always been a really, really good boy in school and all of that, you know? Hey, listen, man, I focused on my studies. But I remember one day he bought this damn magazine to class, right? And he was showing the pages to me. And as I was, a, I, was I was only in the seventh grade, and I was like, what is this? Like, what's that stuff coming out of him? And he was like, dude, you don't know? And I was like, no, what? What is it? And he's like... That's cum, and I'm just like, cum? And he and he's like, yeah, we, all men have that. In, you have it in you too. I'm like, <gasps> I was shocked. I was horrified. I was mortified. I was like, why is that a thing? That's so disgusting. Like, why? Is that? I'm not. Listen, man, this might be a little TMI for y'all, but as a young lad growing up, I discovered sex in the craziest way possible, man. And I even in, in class at one point, I thought that sex. Sex and intercourse were two separate things. I thought you could have sex without intercourse. It was, it was the, it's a long story. I don't want to go too deep in the detail. We're supposed to be playing seat tight, but I mean, damn. I, I had some naive ass moments when I was a little kid, man. I, I wish I could fucking go back and change that, man. I must have looked like a goddamn dumbass. Fuck my life. Uh, yo, dude, I didn't believe it. At that time, I didn't know about ejaculation. I didn't know about orgasm and sperm and semen and all that. So it was just like... I read this, imagine reading a book with no context, and you see a dude shooting white lines on a woman's face. 
<laughs> it was an eye opener, and I'll never forget that shit, man. Shout out to you, Christian. That was a damn good man. <laughs> he let me take that shit home. I wasn't even masculine. That's how naive I was to it. I just had the magazine. I was just like, wow, this is crazy. How are they doing this? And I think like maybe two months after I masturbated for the first time. It was the most ridiculous shit, bro. Uh, I don't know why I'm sharing this with y'all. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's because I ain't got nothing better to do. Oh, wait, we do. Let's play some sleep time. All right, let's fucking go. Y'all ready to continue, man? Resume. Let's continue blasting motherfuckers. Little boy got his ass killed, so... Uh, Let's see what we can do here. Uh, we're gonna build a fort. We're gonna put this bitch right up here. Okay. And I'm going to probably have to refill my ammo. Uh, bye. Was oh, that it? Is that, am I good? Boom. Let's do it. Okay, listen, man. Y'all gotta tell me. We gotta even the ground here, bro. I told y'all way too much information for me to not know something fucked up about y'all. I want someone prestigious from the community. Someone who has a name, some clout, to tell me a real life story of them and their sexual experiences. Although, the more I think about it, the more it just does not seem like something that people would like hide online. You know, like, of course y'all would tell me your sexual experiences. I ain't got a face to the name. I don't know what the fuck half of y'all niggas look like. The only nigga, wait a minute, hold on, we're gonna have to have a motherfucking Etika World Network um, beauty contest. A beauty pageant for every single person in the Etika World Network. Who's the most beautiful, the most handsome, the most good looking person who's part of the fucking fandom, the viewership, okay? Now, of course, I win everything by default, but I mean, that's not gonna be fair. So we're gonna have to motherfucking find niggas that look good. You know. <laughs> Listen, pause, no homo. I don't mean anything by it, alright? I'm not trying to fuck you or uh, nothing like that, but I'm just saying. Y'all ever, ever seen what motherfucking Aurora looks like, bro? Aurora is a handsome mother... He look like Nav. The nigga look like Nav. You know, uh, nothing for my niggas because I'm Nav. Like, bro, I, I'm just saying, man. But, I, I mean, I would beat him, of course. But, I mean, hey, the motherfucker look, <laughs> the motherfucker look good, okay? I'm just being real. Listen, if, if, like, I'm not uncomfortable with my sexuality as to where I cannot compliment another man's appearance, okay? There's nothing gay about that. Even if it was gay, who cares? So it's gay. So what? Nigga, everybody's gay nowadays, man. And everything can be gay. Who cares? Stop being judgmental. Y'all motherfuckers are jumping to conclusions and shit. Anyways, let me continue the motherfucking stunt out here. Y'all dudes are making me pissed off right now, man. Well, we, got, we gotta spend everything, right? Can I get another fucking bed? We're gonna get a turret. Yeah, why not? We're gonna close that shit. Where's the turret at? Oh, I gotta build it. Whoops. Nigga, I'm about to run out of ammo or what? Oh, no, I'm dead. Blasting niggas. Fuck that. Let's see here. Um, yo, we got Anna Cross in here. What's going on? Welcome back to the stream, Anna Cross. Yo, my bad about earlier. I, I know I kind of missed your donation. I, I feel bad about that shit. My bad. Dang, isn't that around the time where you tried to fuck a grapefruit? No, it wasn't a grapefruit, it was peanut butter. Hey, listen, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. Sexual inexperience, man, you do the darndest things. I know some girls, listen, I'll tell you something. I know, I know some girls in real life, real life stories that told me, oh yeah, when I was first discovering my sexuality, I just used to like take random shit and just shove it straight up the vajoo, you know? Like, fuck it, let's just see what this does. I, like, this one girl, you know, I, I used to shove a hairbrush up there. I used to shove a motherfucking cucumber, a frozen banana. I used to be doing the whole thing. I'm like, what the fuck? How do you even, like... Bro, this shit is crazy out here, man. Motherfuckers don't care. Okay, hold on a second. Are we, what the fuck's going on right now? I'm not seeing my damn stream number thing. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm going to get rid of this shit. It's not working. I'm gonna get rid of this. Fuck it. I don't know why it's not working, but it, it's gonna be a blue box from now on. Uh, we have Bobo coming back in saying, since you are talking about sex, how old were you when you first found out where babies come from? It was, it was around the same time. Like, I mean, it was like I was 14 years old. A lot of that stuff was sort of like kept away because my mom she was a good mom you know she she was able to keep me away from all that perverted shit but of course going to a damn school where other young men are yeah it was gonna come out eventually bro and i remember it was around the same time when i started masturbating when i started fucking um watching porno reading pornos motherfucking looking up shit man then it all came together it was like a goddamn revelation and next thing you know it was like boom 
That's where babies come from. It was a fucking, listen, it happened eventually, bro. I think it happened relatively late for me. Maybe some of y'all niggas, you had to experience that shit earlier. Unfortunately, hey, look, I know if I ever have a child, if I ever have a son, an offspring, a little nigga, I am going to ensure that he knows about everything by like 16. 16 is a good age, you know? Although I feel like they would discover it themselves. Boy, you learned at 14. Yeah, okay, I'm a little bit of a late boomer, you know? That, that, that's just how it is, man. I've accepted the shit. You niggas need to do so too. I know that's late. I know that's late. I'm reading the card. Yeah, I know. But I mean, you were age 10? How do you find out about it at age 10? I mean, what? How, uh, Alex, be real with me. Oh, come on. Be real with you, What? 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 How old were you when you first discovered the birds and the bees and um, all that other stuff? Like, when did you discover that that's how it really went down? 12, 13. 12, 13. Okay. Not, not like 14, like 12, you think? Like a young, you were like, Yeah, I was like, how old, how old are you in like 6th grade? Because I, I was around that. 6th grade? I was in like the 7th, 8th grade. So like later. Like first. 14, almost 15. When I learned like, how? I don't, dude, it was. I really mean, we're weird. from different eras. Yeah. And, and I had more internet. Oh, you know yeah, I mean? the internet. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's think yeah, about yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's something. <laughs> yeah, all right, yeah. You know, I didn't have the internet back then. Right, we, we did? Are, we are a different generation. But yeah, but it wasn't as advanced as, like, it is, you know, back, well, at least when you, you were in know, that group. You want to know a confession right now? You guys want to know a confession? I want to know a confession. Right if we're getting all dirty and weird yeah, right let's now, get I on my stream. Yo, Toe was good, by the way. Yeah, man. Let's really get the secrets, motherfucker. No, um, when I was, when I was young in middle school and I was discovering stuff, I uh, mm -hmm. I used to browse for stuff on uh, on my Nintendo DS. Really? What the? Wait, there was a browser in there? The Nintendo DSi. It was like the first one to have a browser on. It was so bad, wow. so bad, dude. But I remember sitting there, low key, Google Images, Megan Fox. <laughs> wow. Oh. With the stylus in one hand With the stylus. and the stylus in the other Boy, hand. Okay, I don't know why so <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Bro, someone said everyone did that. Yo, everyone that's what did everyone that. did that. Everyone. Megan Fox they say, yo, listen, man. Yo, I'ma tell y'all some real shit, bro. My mom used to get like these fashion magazines. She used to get these fashion magazines. And they'd be coming in through the mail, right? And it'd be like, oh, look at these new looks for the season. My dumb, young, horny ass used to get the fashion magazines and go through the pages to the swimsuit section. And I'd be like, ooh. <laughs> The JC, JC Benny, Benny. This dude that used to be my shit. I'd be like, wow! <laughs> Please don't tell me that I was the only one that did that. I know y'all must have done that shit, bro. Please, do, be real with me. Same? Yes, exactly. And across. Thank you. Be real. I did that shit when I was young, bro. I was like, looking through. I was like, oh, gee. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> Some of y'all might still do that shit now, nigga. Yo, EW Network donating. Why are you donating to his stream and my stream? What the fuck? How the fuck are you so fucking comfortable talking all this shit in a room full of niggas? Well, it ain't the first time, bro. I've said this shit in real life to a room full of niggas. I said it online to a room full of niggas. Look, as you matter of fact, bro, you seeing this party right now? This shit is about, this shit is starting to liven up. Listen, dog, this, this fucking... Look, look yeah, at this it's shit. Gonna be like a whole shit thing I think this might be a motherfucking party at some point, hey, bro. I mean, we, we gonna make it one. Uh huh. Oh, Damn think. right, bro. As a matter of fact, man, I'm about to go to the liquor store and pick me up another it's bottle right of this. Next door. It's right there, man. Shop, it's like, so this shit close. Is so weird. Like, it's a. No, it's not. I want some spaghetti. You get them. Ah. Whoa! You spilled this spaghetti. I'm gonna talk about that spaghetti. <laughs> all right, that's fucked up. Okay. Well, it's all right, man. That's how it is sometimes. Sometimes you just drop your spaghetti. It's, it's, it's a natural part of life, you know what I mean? He dropped the spaghetti. Yeah, it happens, man. <laughs> it happens, bro. It's really buttery. I know, it's so slippery. It, it, it like, it went in my mouth and then it I slipped thought it, out. I thought it was in your mouth. I, I mean, too. I it, go. it felt solid. That's why I didn't move, but I mean, fuck. Listen, man. Y'all are in the same situation. Make sure your fucking your head placement is accurate, because otherwise you can avoid a mess. Oh man, so, so how's it men walking around? What's everything looking like? It seems like there's more of a party going on. Um, 
there's other shoes. Honestly, it's like, mm, it's okay. It's okay. It's getting there, though. Listen, yeah. I think a bigger bottle of this, a couple for oh, everyone, and that, then oh, that's, sure. that's, that's a party. Now we're sure. talking, yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? I, um, it, there is a severe lack of alcohol here. I think so, too. Yeah, yeah but you know what? Joy Con boys, we can fix that shit. <laughs> we're going to provide the solution. We're going to sacrifice ourselves to make this shit go down. Yeah. We're, in, we're in Vegas, after all. How do you go a night without getting a little bit tipsy in Vegas? Exactly, you know right? what I'm saying? It's standard. It's natural. Tipsy, just tipsy. Shoot. How's the stream doing? Everybody doing all right in there? What y'all up to? I'm doing good. Okay, okay, okay. I see y'all in there. Shout out to the stream chat. Your names are way too complicated for me to even begin to read. Like, fuck. Uh, yo, what's up, man? Feel good, man? Yeah, thank you. Appreciate that, man. Um, yo, I'll see y'all in here. I see y'all waving. Oh, what's waving, going on? Waves. Hi. Hi. Hello, is Wait, what? Yeah, that is my favorite. favorite. Hey, we're going to be here for a couple uh, more hours. Are you staying overnight? Uh, yeah, I have a, um, yeah, I have a hotel room in here. But Wait, you live in Vegas? No, no, no. Oh. no I live in LA. Oh, okay, okay. But you're, yeah. you're driving back? Uh, not tonight. Like, okay. okay, so I'll see you last around. Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. Yeah. We got to do some more shots. Oh, yeah, you guys are hanging out? Tonight? Well, fuck it. Maybe not tonight, but maybe, like, tomorrow? Okay. If you guys are doing anything, let me know. I'll come through. I'll, I'll, I'll elevate it, you know what I'm saying? Gotcha. Skull Kid, what's up, man? He says, to be honest, Etika, I saw a hentai at the age of nine. That's kind of young. But what year was it? All right? I was nine years old in the year 1999. I mean... If I saw a hentai back then, it might have fucked with my head. Who knows? Maybe I did see a hentai back then, and that's why I'm fucked up in the head now. Someone said, Etika's going to get laid. Hey, listen. No, 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 no. So, son's going to give him the hands? Hey, listen. Hey, listen. Stop bringing son up in this shit, okay? No. Listen, if son gave me the hands, all right, I, I, I would win. Because the motherfucking KSI is going to lose the fight, okay? God bless America. <laughs> I'm kidding. Listen, I'm about to tea party motherfuckers out here, okay? Skull Kid, man. I feel bad that your first experience had to be at that age with that kind of content. But you know what? There's worse that's happened out there. It's probably made you into a better person anyways now because you, you're, you're fully aware of how perverted you are. You know what I'm saying? You can make a conscious decision to stop the shit. Um, I saw both porn and hentai at the age of 10 years old. That's very, very fresh right there. Um, and I, Iron Avenger says, I love niggers. Thank you, man. Appreciate that. And we have another donation coming in. And this one is from Lil Chu. Oh, boy. I'm glad to see your ass in here, too, man. Your goddamn, your meme post have been fucking me up. Like, he says, damn, nigger. I thought you got banned. Well, listen, bro, look, I don't care. I don't care how long it's been. The Joy-Con niggers, we can avoid. Man, the only time we ever got in trouble for shit like that was, like, some complicated shit. And you know what? YouTube, they, they fixed it. They realized that, oh, it actually wasn't, like, something ban worthy and they just were like yo you're good so i mean we're good here i can handle it i only deleted it because it was like i didn't know what showed i know something showed but i'm not sure what considering like my layout is different and i'm working on a totally foreign setup i mean i think i managed it pretty well youtube notified me you're back streaming again and i'm back in limp mode watching you stream i haven't said hi to you for a long time why did you walk up time why did excuse me why did you capitalize time what the fuck did you even say in that last message you asked me to walk up to cnd and say something and it disappeared i don't know what the fuck's going on here but yushubu came back through with 25 dollars saying this is my first time once again yo yushu i like your name it's easy for me to pronounce thank you he says um I did not know about masturbation until 15 years of age. And I didn't do it until a couple of months before I turned 16. Shout out to my boy Retro and Afro Sakurai. Why did you shout out Retro and Afro right after mentioning your first time masturbating? Do you understand the kind of context that sets up? Retro, I hope you didn't help this motherfucker. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? How do you get niggas to help you? That's like some circle jerk shit. How do you stand in a circle full of niggas and you just... <laughs> what the fuck? People really do that? Do people organize circle jerks? Bro, you know at MAGFest? At MAGFest they had a circle jerk? Oh, they had... Orgies at MAGFest? Orgies? So just fluids flying. Hold, hold on. I'm about to go explain some stuff and this video. Orgies? Is that some milk? It is. Alright, um, BRB. Uh, I didn't know Magfest gets it in like that. Blockhead, let me find out. Okay, so listen. Okay. Blockhead so, knows too. Blockhead yes. knows? Listen, I know a couple things. I saw a couple pictures of a couple individuals. So apparently, like, so you know how they're, I'll tell you about Magfest. Like, you're going there, 100%. Uh-huh, I'm going. And, um, 
there's like the arcade room, there's the console gaming room, there's the vendor room, there's the there's the dance hall room, all just open 24-7, right? Oh my In the Lord. arcade room, apparently this is what it was last year, you had to like go to some, uh, like a certain arcade cabinet and there was a guy and you had to go there wearing a certain cosplay. Then you have to ask them a certain something, then they would tell you the room number and the and the code to get in. Then you go to that code and apparently it's just all night long, it's just a room filled with people just 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 doing it. Engaging. Just yeah, it's just yeah. Wow. You so just walk in there and it's just a free for all apparently. I don't know. But like the amount of people that are telling me like it's a thing, I've seen it, I walked past the room and like like looked inside for a second. It's real. At a certain arcade cabinet? You mean to tell me that... Like, no, no, I don't know what... I mean, that's just what it was last year, but apparently each year is like a scavenger hunt because they need to keep it so low-key. Oh, but it's a real... To find the orgy? What if we What if we went on a journey to find that shit? Dude, life Ourselves. Yeah, just taking we this shit there. around. We in there. Like, Yo, you guys ready gonna, for this? Are y'all ready to <laughs> find the orgy? MAGFest 2019. Let me know what I want if you want to see that shit. I'll hunt, I'll hunt me an orgy. I'll do it. I'm ready for it. I'm not gonna engage in it, but you know, I'll find it. Is that a furry? Yes, that is a. We have a couple furries in here now, man. Uh, I'm only about like four of them right now. I was I was about to call the police, but I'm a little bit busy at the moment. Hopefully, somebody else can do it. Okay. Um, wait, wait a minute. I just realized. Um, gay orgy boys. I mean, hey, listen, bro. I don't know what kind of orgies they threw, but I'm, we're gonna find them. The orgy hunters. The you heard of the ghost hunters, nigga? These are the orgy hunters. I'm about to pull my dick up. Uh, let me see. Bring over the furries. Okay, listen, man. All right, you know what? We got to talk to a furry. You want you want me to go find y'all a furry? I'm about to go find a furry. I found one. I went through the fields and I found one. Bro, well, up, well, welcome to the stream, man. Hey, Naveed, how are you? Naveed, his name's Naveed. This is the stream right here. They, they, hey, they, guys. How's it going, man? Hey. Uh, we, they wanted to ask a couple oh. questions, so... Eight inches. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, what was the questions? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. You had questions. <laughs> <laughs> how, how long have you been part of this lifestyle? Oh, I love it, man. Is it... Love it. Is, is it, like... Is it a nightly thing? Oh my god. Uh, nightly? Well, nightly? I didn't even know there was an option to take this off. Are you telling me I can oh, take this off? It's built in? It's part bro. Oh. Hey look, you're not born you don't learn this. You're I'm, born with this. You know yeah, what I mean? I, I figured as much, man. <laughs> Wait a minute. So how yeah. much vagina on a regular basis does this harvest? Oh, I mean, I already got my own flaps. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, you know, you know what? You're right. Y'all boys ever been with one of those kinds? Where it's just, yeah. Hey, hey, just make it clap. Listen, the, more, the more surface area, the better. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, man. Hey, listen, man. Thank you're you the best, bro. The hey, you, you know, got it. Just like, also, oh, another yeah. thing. When do you see yourself leaving this lifestyle, this, this, this furry lifestyle? You know what, man? Blood in, blood out. No leave. Damn, <laughs> really? To the to the grave, apparently. Well, you heard it here first. We just had a conversation with a furry that we found in the wild. And apparently, this lifestyle's been integrated since birth. And apparently it harvests them some 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 bountiful assets with intimacy. Quite interesting. Hopefully we find a different one that can give us a, a, a whole new perspective on what it is to be a furry. I think this was interesting. I'll catch you later on National Nigger Graphic. <laughs> All right? We will find. We will find another furry. Or maybe I'll become a furry by the next time. Then I want. If, yo, listen. I'm going to tell y'all something right now. If I ever become a furry legitimately, bro, you can just d d report me. <laughs> report my channel. Get me shot. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm sorry. I'm, I grew up in early internet days. For me, it's funny to make fun of furries, even though I don't really see anything wrong with the way they live. I mean, but hey. It's, it's just part of the culture, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's just how black jokes are still funny. Everyone laughs at black jokes. <laughs> I laugh at black jokes. You laugh at black jokes. Don't lie. I mean, it's, it's just something that will never lose appeal. Just like...
furries can always yiff in hell, and just like um, gingers have no souls, you know what I mean? If you're a furry or a ginger right now, you're probably feeling attacked as fuck. But don't worry, I'll attack everybody. Fuck everyone, okay? Okay. Let's continue playing um, some... Uh, Etika, I'm a furry, no joke. Oh, shit. I think we just had a serious comment, man. Somebody's pissed off. Etika, I'm a furry, no joke. No, 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 that's, that's fine. I don't, I'm not criticizing your lifestyle. Uh huh. He said that his, uh, he wants to convert his homie into a Joy Con boy. Uh huh. So, like, what game should we get him? What game? Bro, what kind of quip, man? You should. Sure? Yeah, there's one I think go right away, man. What? Senren Kagura Shinobi Refle. <laughs> you want to be a Joy Con boy? You yeah. pick that up? Bro, you get such an immersive experience. You can smell the gunpowder. It's just, like, right there. Exactly. Like, this is part of it. Is that the is that the Jay Lee Thai one? That's the that's the the old Pai one. Bro. So you heard it here first, the Jay Lee Thai Joy Con game. So uh, my man, that's what you gotta get. Him. There's no other Nintendo game <laughs> which encompasses the experience of the Switch all together in a package as compressed as Shinobi. <laughs> Learn something. What? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, waifu? I'm jumping between niggas' and streams. CMB streaming. I'm streaming. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Hold on a second, bro. We have waifu in here saying, bro, the first time that I had sex, I forgot to take my durag off. <laughs> and we had a pregnancy scare. That was the scariest shit of my life. I hope you're having fun in Vegas, dog. Once again, another instance as to where those two sentences do not correlate to me. How in the fuck does a do-rag staying on during sex equate to you possibly getting somebody pregnant, okay? Listen, have you ever used your do-rag as a condom? No, so therefore, that shouldn't have anything to do with it. You transitioned like it did. Well, hopefully it didn't, man. Listen, I, I be sleeping with a do-rag, too. I fucked in a do-rag before. Yo, yo, as a matter of fact, one of the girls... Well, <laughs> I shouldn't say one of them. I mean, like, the, the times I've had sex before, they be like, oh, I like the do-rag. It's hot. <laughs> You're like a hood nigga. <laughs> you ever had sex with somebody? Have you ever had to, Imagine a dude, a black dude, having sex with somebody who's Caucasian, and she just be like, yeah, fuck me, you dirty nigga. <laughs> It's like, God damn. Um, yeah, it's, yeah, that's okay if you find that, like, a turn on, okay. Have you seen, I saw a meme like that where it's like, yeah, fuck me, you, you, daddy. <laughs> like, excuse me? Whoa, I didn't expect things to get that serious. Nimbus Hero out here with a $25 contribution. Nimbus flying Nimbus motherfucking Kakara. We need Kid Goku for damn Fighter Z. I've been watching since the X and Y days, and now the IRS finally caught me. They said I'm behind on my etiquette tax. Ah, didn't see it coming. Very, very nice. It's funny. Your boy's having some tax problems too, bro. Well, I mean, not really tax problems, but you know, I'm playing the tax man. I'm motherfucking giving some some, some cheddar here, there, and everything. You know, it's a, it's kind of like a, it's it kind of sucks, you know. Like the fact that Uncle Sam wants to just come in and be like, boom. He's like, yo, <laughs> time to pay up, nigga. You live in my country, you'll pay my tax. Like, I, I don't know, man. There's, there's some places that you don't pay tax, like Delaware, but I mean, yeah. Okay, we got to play. We, wait, yo, bro, you were C&D. This rarely happens. Much love to the both of you. Yo, my, wait, yo, my, yo somebody said, yo, you were C&D. Hey, this is so rare, bro. Yo, man, much love to this motherfucker. Hey, man. Yo, man, it. somebody came through showing some love, man. Some nigga. He was uh, like, Nimbus, yo, hey. Yo, 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 that's, my, that's my boy right there. Oh, that wasn't him. Somebody oh, in the chat. Someone, oh, it was in chat, chat. Nice. But, but hey. still, though, man. Appreciate it, man. man. A lot of people are wilding out. They're like, wow, you guys are together. Like, they, it's like, they're talking about us like we're a couple or some shit. Like, right. what the fuck? Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. I mean, I don't call this man Desi Bear or nothing. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop. I'm really going to stop now. <laughs> well, I'm going to move your chair and send you back over <laughs> there. Right. Peace out. Yo, call me Desi Bear again if you if you, if you, if you want to get your asses cut. Call me Desi Bear, bro. Fuck that. Son, I hate you once again. <laughs> like, oh my god, I've, I've never hated a girl so lovingly before, you know what I'm saying? Okay, boys, thank you very, very much. We gotta jump back into this motherfucking sleep tight shit, though. It's 1018, bro. 1030, what do you. Okay, 11? Okay. 11? Yeah, that sounds fine. Well, then, I don't know, because right now I'm trying to motherfucker. We'll, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. What the fuck is this? I'm just gonna get me some power ups, defenses. Uh, boom. Uh, I'm gonna put a turret right in here. You know what, to be honest with you, even though I haven't really been focusing too much on the game, I'm gonna be very real. 
I actually kind of like the game. I mean, it's a simple concept, right? It's something that you can just easily get with. Okay, ammo. Is that something I haven't done yet? Okay, here we go. Yeah, alright, I see you guys trolling me with the fucking with the bear shit. You know, it's funny, I told that girl so many times before, like, you can't call me that shit around niggas, and she still doesn't anyways. Like, these are my homies. You can't call me a fucking Desi bear in front of my fucking homies. Fuck. Did they niggas say, just die saying you suck? Oh, okay. And I got body. Fuck. She doesn't even give a f F. Fuck, nigga. F for fuck, nigga. Shit. All right. Yo, 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 yo. L legit. Yo, I'm about to mother... Okay, you guys think I'm joking. You know I'm not fucking playing. Keep going. Keep going. You think I can't fucking time out every single person that's in here? Keep... Yeah, go ahead. Try me. Try me, motherfucker. Give me a moment. I, I, I got to, like, set up some shit right now. Hold on a second. Let me make sure... I know, I'm not sure if the stream is healthy or not. Is everything good with the quality? Yeah, okay, you know what? I see you guys are clearly having a bunch of fun antagonizing me as usual. All right, you know. Huh? Fuck. Okay, yeah, all right. You know what? I, I don't even feel like I have to take the effort to time you guys out because... Deep down, you all know that this shit is fucked up. You're, 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 you're fucking with me, and it's, like, wrong. Hopefully you go to sleep tonight and you don't toss and turn. Bastards. <laughs> but all right, dudes. Yo, so far, so good. I kind of like the game a lot. I know I said I was going to stream it until longer, but right now, there are things to do. There are places to go. There are people to meet. There are drinks to drink. There's stuff to happen right now. Boys, I will be seeing you all later but we're, we're gonna chill we're gonna chill for a little bit more we're gonna chill for a little bit more we can talk for a little bit more yeah definitely without a doubt well, but we're not signing out just yet we're not signing out just yet but i definitely wanted to like motherfucking just chill here because i i'm having a good time in here right now bro is this a masturbation stream it could be i could make it that if you guys really wanted me to i mean do you want it shirt story etika hmm shirt story can't happen yet i told you motherfuckers it's some legal shit i tell that story I fly, I fly back to new york i get arrested bro i'm not trying to have that happen right now talk to nintendo well nintendo seems busy motherfucking. you know as a matter of fact well, you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna take this niggas i'm gonna take this niggas food Is he looking at me? Oh shit, this motherfucker! Where'd you even get that from? This 